It's all yours. Good evening. I'd like to call the City of Menasha Administration Committee meeting to order. Clerk Galia or Clerk Crow Kramer, could we have the roll, please? Alderman Nichols. Yeah. Here. Alderman Taylor. Here. Alderman Sevenick. Alderman Sevenick. Here. Alderman I was just Smith? bringing up the agenda. Sorry. Alderman Smith. Here. Alderman Tom Grady. Here. Alderman Ted Grady. Here. Alderman Rapella. Here. All are present with the absence of Alderman Langdon. Thank you. We have minutes to approve from the administration committee meeting of November 2nd, 2020. Is there a motion? I'll make the motion to approve the minutes. Uh, the administration. I'll make yeah. the motion to approve the minutes of the administration committee for 11 to 20. I'll and second it. Sorry, I thought you broke up there. <laughs> we have a motion from Alderman Rapella and a second by Alderman Tom Grady to approve the minutes. Is there any discussion? Seeing none, all in favor signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed, nay? Minutes are approved. We have one action item this evening, and that is Ordinance 1020, an ordinance amending Title VII, Chapter 8 of the Code of Ordinances regarding a street use permit. And I guess I'm going to start with Director Schrader uh, to provide a summary of what is being proposed here. I would actually uh, push that to uh, City Clerk Crow Kramer. Ooh. Okay, Clerk Crow Kramer. So this ordinance is changing the number of tables that can be placed on the front facing side of a, a business. Um, you'll see there are some, there is some language that has been omitted and some that has been added at this time. So currently the ordinance, uh, prohibit, or I mean, sorry, permits tables to be, uh, in front of the licensed property and in front of neighbors' properties if the neighbor has granted permission? Right. And this change would just limit it to the front of their building that they would indicate on their outdoor serve application. Okay. First, I'd look for a motion before discussion can begin. Alderman Sevenick. Okay, sure. I'll make the motion. For the oh, geez, for ordinance 01020. And is there a second? I'll second it. We have a motion by Alderman Sevenick and a second by Alderman Ted Grady to recommend this ordinance to Common Council. Any discussion? Actually, it's just changes to the ordinance. But if I could. Um, attorney, can I ask, I ask attorney captain if this needs to go to common council, the changes? Yes. Yes, okay. Um, Alderman Sevenick. Actually, it was originally going straight to council, but both the mayor and I felt it should go through the regular process first through administration and then to the common council basically what has happened here if you notice i'm the sponsor and the reason for that is i was contacted by businesses uh, along main street that were concerned about the number of tables that are being put out all the way along downtown and that they wanted to keep it restricted to just their business um, there was some concern i was contacted uh, mainly by uh bill bonte from lemon loves lime he was concerned about 
uh, especially with the new uh, uh, business going in that will be serving beer, that we would basically have a, a total bar from one end of the street to the to the other. And um, I think personally, I agree with him that it should be restricted to your own business and not necessarily the property that you might own because you might own the, the business next to it. And that's what this takes care of. Also too, um, for safety reasons, I didn't like it either that they were along the edge of the street where the cars were. Um, I found that to be just maybe a little more dangerous. And these were recommendations that they uh, brought to my attention. And I said, why don't we wait till the end of the year? Because I think it went until this month and to make those changes. Uh, but uh, I mean, this act, actually this ordinance was even stricter at one point. You had to bring those tables and chairs in every time. And that's not being done. Um, uh, they wanted that in there too, but uh, I wasn't ready to go that far yet. So these are just two very small changes to an existing ordinance. For years, Alderman Taylor and myself have been trying to open up the downtown a little bit on the outside. You would not believe the fights we had to go through just to get a sandwich board signed downtown Menasha. And then from there it grew, and he may want to speak a little on this too. Um, then, of course, to allow for tables and chairs, you'd think that'd be a simple thing, but it wasn't. We had to fight for it, and a lot of times it was by one vote, but now it's gotten a little out of control, and now um, I'd like to just keep it within the, the property that you own and not on both, both sides, along your building and then on city property, because you're going to need some clearance there, and uh, although there's probably an somewhat enough clearance i just think it's kind of a safety thing too so uh, i agreed to make those changes and bring it forward to the council thank you for that any other discussion seeing none um all in favor of the proposed ordinance Signify by saying aye. 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 Any opposed? Nay. This ordinance will be forwarded to Common Council. And with that, we'll look for a motion to adjourn. I'll make the motion to adjourn. Second. We have a motion by Alderman Rapella and a second by Alderman Taylor. All in favor or Yes. All in favor, say aye. Aye. 